Hello everybody and welcome to Gaming News. Now, I just read that Square Enix has announced that they've delayed Final Fantasy XV for another two months to November 29th. Now don't lose your crap, everybody just hold on. I know it's crazy and it sucks and oh man, why are they pushing it back? Oh my god, I can't wait for the game, oh my god. Okay, calm down. Everybody needs to calm down. The whole reason they're doing this is to incorporate into the game what would have been considered a day one patch so that the game is done. Now, this is one of the best things I've actually heard coming out of Square Enix, especially with the ongoing trend of releasing unfinished games. Case in point, uh, No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky has the potential to be something fantastic, something great, something wonderful. I've been playing it. It's not all. It's not as bad a game as people are making it out to be, but it also isn't complete. It's not finished. The scope and the span of the game, there's, there's so much that could be done. So much more that could have been done, especially with the delays and the delays and the delays that had been happening. I know that the delays had nothing to do with the game itself. It was more of along the lines about who owned the, the word Sky and a bunch of other nonsensical lawsuits that were going on from uh, Hello Games and other companies. But games have been coming out more broken than anything else. This is actually really good news. I am disappointed that I'm gonna have to wait a little more uh, to get the game. November 29th is 10 days after my birthday, so needless to say, I'm probably gonna get it for my B-Day. Uh, that being said, everybody just needs to calm down. Sometimes we need to push things back, especially since they've actually communicated with us what's going on especially with the fact that you know day one patches are such a pain in the ass they're such a burden you want to get a game and you want to play it that is the whole point if you get a game for your birthday you get a game for Christmas you get a game for whatever reason you know a gift from a friend gift from a mom gift from an aunt uncle blah 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 whatever the point is you want to throw it into your system and play it it's what you used to do it's what we all have grown accustomed to and now with all this digital nonsense that's been going on as soon as you buy a game, you put it in your system and you have to wait a half an hour to an hour, depending on how big the day one patch is, depending on how old the game is, and considering how many patches have come to that game since its release. That sucks. No one wants to wait an hour to two hours to play a game that they have physically in their hands. So. Ultimately, I respect Square Enix for their decision to delay the game. I also respect them for actually communicating what's been going on and what's going on and why they're doing what they're doing. Releasing a completed game is never a bad thing. I will always advocate for this. I don't care how angry you guys get. I don't care how disappointed you guys are. I am disappointed. No lie, I am very disappointed. I've been waiting and looking forward to this game for a really long time. I have a feeling this is going to be one of the best. Um, I can't wait, but I am not angry with them. I understand the logic behind it. It needs to be done. This kind of trend needs to start all over again. People need to release games complete, finished, done, so that when we get them, there is no day one patch. You know, you want to patch something? Add DLC. Add downloadable content that's actual content, something that will actually benefit the game, benefit the players, and benefit us as a whole as consumers. That's what needs to happen. No more broken games. No more releasing broken games and trying to fix them throughout the course of its, you know, lifespan. Because a lot of times it doesn't actually get finished. So release a finished game. Square Enix, good on you. Good on you. I give you a hand. This is a responsible way to run your business. Um, you're getting positive feedback from me. I know a lot of people get really, really butthurt on the fact that the delay is coming and it's, it's going to be two months. That means the patch was going to be huge. It was either going to be four to another nine to eight gigs of patching. No one wants to download that on day one. So everybody just calm down, take a breath, wait until November 29th. Time is flying this year. I'm sure November is going to hit us faster than when we can even expect it. So with that said, that's the news that I got for you guys today. 
Uh, leave some comments down below. Let me know what else you guys have heard. If you've heard any rumors, if you've got any other little news that I might not have touched up on yet. I'm going to keep reading some uh, articles and see what I can find and dig them up and throw them out there for you guys to read or to listen to or what have you. So, as always, it's always awesome to hang out with you guys and let you know what's going on. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching The Rock Place.